In recent years, China has emerged as one of the top three economic powers globally. However, its rapid economic growth has led to a substantial increase in copper ore consumption, accounting for 47% of the world's total. Despite China's copper production exceeding 2 million tons, it falls short of meeting the internal demand. To address this, China acquired the Los Bambos copper mine in Peru for $6 billion, which annually yields 290,000 tons of copper. This acquisition was initially seen as a successful overseas investment. However, tensions arose after a secret visit by the United States to Peru in 2022, following which local residents near the Los Bambos mine protested and blockaded roads. Efforts by China to negotiate with the locals proved unsuccessful, leading to the mine facing imminent closure. The residents demanded environmental protection revisions, construction of a railway for ore transport, and job opportunities, which China rejected due to feasibility and cost concerns. This situation poses significant challenges for China. Copper, a crucial raw material for key industries like electronics and automotive manufacturing, is in high demand. China, being the largest consumer and processor of copper globally, heavily relies on imports, making supply shortages a real concern. Closure of the Los Bambos mine would disrupt the supply chain, increase manufacturing costs, potentially lead to unemployment, and slow down economic growth. To prevent the closure, China must engage in diplomatic negotiations with Peru, address environmental concerns, and consider providing viable alternatives for local employment and infrastructure development. Finding a mutually beneficial solution is essential to ensuring a stable supply of copper, safeguarding industries, and sustaining economic growth. If you have any thoughts or suggestions on how to manage the situation, feel free to share your opinions in the comments section. Your input is valuable. Thank you for watching and supporting. See you next time.